Hi guys, it's your boy Nikki. Welcome to another vlog. Thank you for subscribing to my channel and like and share. Thank you all so much for support my channel. Today I'll be making some rice, gilbaka curry, and some fried okra and shrimp. So I'm just getting started. Once I get everything set up, I'll show you the ingredients. And thank you all so much once again who like and support my channel and who share my channel. Thank you all so much. So guys, as you can see, I throw my rice inside. My rice is boiling. I got my okra over here, all chipped. I leave some whole okra to throw in the gilbaka curry. I didn't want to cut up all of it. So that's some okra right there that I chip up to cook the fried okra and shrimp. And that's my rice boiling. And that's my gilbaka in the bowl already defrosting right there. I'm gonna just wash it just in a second and get it prepared up to cook. So that's my fish, my fried okra, and my rice. I didn't take the shrimp out of the fridge yet. So hi guys, so this is my ingredients for my um, fried okra and my gilbaka curry. So over here, I got my masala, my curry powder, two cubes, my jeera, my green seasoning, my garlic, that's for the fish curry with my okra, and for the fried okra I got my shrimps, I got my tomato, my onion, and I got shallots, I got mint leaf, I got my celery, I got my mango for my fish curry over here. I didn't get it started yet, so I'm gonna start it right now. So hi guys, I'm cutting off my ingredients now for my fish curry and my okra.
So guys, I'm cutting up the tomato now. This is for the um, okra, and I have one here for the fish curry. I don't have enough myself as now for my fish curry. Some salary for my fish curry. So guys, this is how my setup looks right now for my fry okra on my gabaka curry with egg. This is for my um, okra, this is a tomato, garlic, an onion, and the shrimp. And for fish curry, I have my um, tomato, garlic, masala, curry powder, aji, green seasoning, a piece of ginger, my onion, two chicken cubes, my pepper, and I, I got my shallot, my celery, and my mint leaf here, as you can see. I'm gonna get started with the okra right now. So guys, here's my okra already chipped and everything and washed done. So guys, I'm adding my onion now to fry my okra. The oil is hot.
for the onion so you can fry it so it's not gonna like you don't want it to fry and get burned. Keep an eye on it and have like a slight brown color and you can add your rest of the stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna add my garlic and my tomatoes, my pepper now. I'm gonna add my okra in now, and then I'm gonna add the shrimp a lot. Cause the shrimp, I already fried when I bring it from Guyana already, so I'm gonna fry it back. For the last minute, then I'm gonna add it in. Guys, this is how my fried okra look for now. Doesn't it look good already? Okay guys, you can fry your okra on a low heat. You want to fry it on a high heat for it to burn in the bottom. When you fry it on low heat, it cooks really nice. And it looks one by one. Okay? So guys, this is how my okra coming along. Coming along pretty good. I did not add the shrimps as yet. Are you ready? Uh, this is my okra look like when it is from inside. So guys, this is a small teaspoon, like a baby teaspoon, half a teaspoon of salt, which it may show like a lot, but it's not a lot. So guys, you want to turn it too hard. If you turn the okra too hard, it can break. As you see, it's nice and like not to break too much. So you don't want to turn it too hard. So guys, here's my gilbaka. My okra, my mangoes, my salad, my celery, my mint leaf, 
and I got my all ingredients in there which I already told you guys what is that what is in there and I got four eggs I'm gonna add to it so guys I'm adding my onions now to the cook my vegetarian that is hot This is the mint leaf, celery, and shallot. So, guys, this is the fish is already washed and everything already. So, I'm gonna add in now so you can watch it with the masala. So guys, this is my mango. I washed it in my okra. I already washed it and put it in now. So guys, this is how it looks for now. This is the gilbaka curry. And this is the fried okra with shrimp. I'm going to add the water now and let it boil. Guys, I'm adding a little salt into the fish curry now. I'm gonna add my water now so the fish can boil too.
I'm also going to put four egg inside. Guys, this is look good. So once again guys, please like. Subscribe and share and turn the notification icon on so every time I post a new video you get a notification. My okra is almost coming to a finish. It's just my fish curry had to cook now. So once again thank you all so much for um, supporting my channel and sharing and subscribe. Thank you. So guys my okra is done, I'm draining it out now in here, put it in the strainer so the oil can drain out. So guys this is how my fish go back a curry coming along. It's boiling now. So guys, this is the finished fry okra and um, the kebaka curry and egg and uh, mango and okra inside as the rice. So I'm gonna set a plate and do a, a taste test for you guys. So guys, this is the plate I make. This is the kebaka, kebaka curry, the okra, the, uh, a boiled egg, okra and shrimp and some lime sour. Doesn't it look good? Look at the steam coming out. So guys, you see the taste there, you see the steam coming out of it, look. Once again, thank you all who like and subscribe to my channel. I always share my channel. Like and share and subscribe. And thank you all so much. I really appreciate it. And thank you all and I love you all.